for them all to be. But it's just been like people galore, everybody. And it was warm. I mean, really warm. Um, everyone's getting along, just hanging out, patiently waiting, 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 because this is such an historical moment. As this gentleman right here, so I'm going to come over here real right quick. Uh, yeah. What were you saying? Why you came down here today? I just think that this was a historical moment in time for Cleveland sports. And I am tired. I've been over here since 1999. I've been tired of always waiting for next year, okay? Um, Finally, a championship came to town, and it is a great feeling and a great moment in time. I was going to say, we I, for once, we don't have to say those words. Hey, you know what? We don't have to celebrate draft day this year. How about that? You know, like, that's usually the biggest day of the year for us, you know, for, for you know, or at least in terms of basketball. So, um, yeah, very exciting. What did you think about being down here? It was fun, and I got to see, like, all the players in person. It was cool. It would, anyone in particular that you liked, any of their style or their swagger? LeBron. Yeah, it was pretty cool. It was really cool. And what did you think about that trophy? Did you get to see the trophy? Yeah, it was something I'll never forget. It was an awesome experience, and it's something for history. I thought it was really cool. And how about the crowds? I mean, because it really was wall-to-wall -wall people. And I mean, like, we were all, like, on top of each other for hours. You got very close. You got very close to your neighbors, right? Oh, yeah. We were just jam-packed, like, trying to move through people. It was insane, but it was really fun, and I thought it was worth it, so... It was absolutely great. So um, the fans having a good time, the city doing a great job, and absolutely, the celebration, it's not over yet. We're not going to end with just a parade. We have a rally going on, so we're going to send it over to Wayne and Stephanie at Mall B, where the party continues. All right. Suzanne, thanks so much. Boy, what an honor it is to be here and, and watch what has been unfolding all today here at... Uh, downtown Cleveland. I mean, it's just been quite a day. I'm Stephanie Schaefer along with my good friend Wayne Dawson. We've been working together about 25 years and going through these ups and downs that Clevelanders have been going through for 52 years without a championship. John Tellis joining us now. This is the day we've waited for for a long time. I think because we've waited so long, that's what makes it so much sweeter, right? It really does. I mean, I've had the opportunity to cover so many teams over the years, and there have been some close, you know, calls, close instances where, you know, they came within a couple of outs of winning the World Series in 97. You had, of course, the shot and the, uh, and the fumble and the drive with both the Cavs and then the Browns on two occasions. Um, but through it all, uh, this region has always lived, ate, and drank sports and their love of the sports teams and that's been a constant it, it hasn't wavered it's been disappointment yes but always some emotional value invested in what's happening on the playing field or on the court or the baseball diamond or on the ice and so that's that has not changed so it's great to have a winner to talk about kind of an update on what we're doing right now we're waiting for the cavaliers to take the stage and uh, Everyone has pretty much congregated. They've congregated out here at, at, on Mall B, the stage behind us. And as I look down Lakeside Avenue, a lot of people have gone home. Yeah. They've been here for the parade. They've Go gotten back. their taste of the Cavaliers. They probably want to rush home so they can see this part on TV. Go feed their families, because a lot of folks have been here all day, out in the heat and the sun. But you don't see anyone complaining. It's that day no. where everyone's in this euphoric high and so excited. That great camaraderie and that right. great moment that we're all experiencing together it's really something it's it's so special the parade was absolutely spectacular in the sense that it was an opportunity for these guys to really be out there amongst <laughs> their fans and to be themselves whether it's with a shirt on or no shirt right. but to and see them a good right time. Now, it was sensational to see them getting off their cars off their vehicles and getting in the crowd high fives taking selfies taking pictures and like hugging babies. I mean, just absolutely adorable to see. 